Open the light box using comma and under project miscellaneous click brush 3D template. This is our canvas on which we'll create a vector displacement mesh but we don't want to disturb the edges so mask those out. If you accidentally disturb the edges, at the end you can mask everything but the edges and go to deformation, morph to grid to fix it. Now we can use our sculpting brushes to create our mesh and the great thing about VDMs is that it supports overhanging geometry. If you want to create a brush without this, then you may as well create a standard alpha, which I'll cover in an upcoming tutorial. Once you've sculpted something wonderful, hit B and select the chisel brush, then come to brush, create, create multi alpha brush. You now have your own vector displacement brush, which you can save by going to brush, save as, and save it in this brush presets folder so that it automatically loads whenever you start ZBrush. If you enjoyed this tutorial, please drop a in the comments. Peace.